vision problems after stroke causes and treatment as a stroke can affect various parts of the brain it can cause a wide range of symptoms including changes in balance and vision the type of vision problem that a person may experience depends on the location of the stroke a stroke occurs due to an interruption in the blood supply to a part of the brain a decreased blood supply prevents the brain tissue from getting oxygen and nutrients this blockage can have widespread effects on the body depending on the affected area of the brain some of the main symptoms of a stroke include vision problems in one or both eyes a headache confusion difficulty speaking an inability to move parts of the face arm or leg on one side of the body a person must consult a doctor to discuss and treat any vision issues after a stroke the doctor may help identify any other underlying health problems and recommend treatments this video discusses why vision problems can occur after a stroke it also looks at different types of vision problems in more detail including the treatment options and how to manage the symptoms why do vision problems occur after a stroke vision problems may occur after a stroke due to damage in a certain part of the brain brain cells die quickly without oxygen and a loss of blood supply to the brain stops the cells of oxygen if a stroke affects the part of the brain that controls and receives information from the eyes this can cause vision problems for instance a stroke can damage the occipital lobe which is responsible for processing visual inputs a stroke can also affect the brain stem which handles visual balance interpreting objects and eye movements vision problems that a person had before a stroke may also worsen after a stroke or add to any new visual impairment that it causes vision problems are very common after a stroke according to research from 2019 About 60% of people who survive a stroke have a visual impairment to some degree. However, the percentage of people who experience symptoms varies widely among the types of impairment. Types of vision problems after stroke. In some cases, vision changes may be temporary or improve with training. However, other vision changes may be permanent. A person may experience various types of vision problems after a stroke. Visual field loss. The visual field is everything a person can see when they focus their eyes on a particular point. It will include any direct objects straight ahead as well as everything around them and to the sides. If a person experiences a visual field loss, they will lose the ability to see part of this field of vision. The type of field field loss will depend on the area of the brain that the stroke affected. Visual field loss may occur on one side in each eye so that, for example, a person can only see on the left or right side. This type the most common following a stroke is called hemianopia and training may be necessary to help the person cope with the changes to their field of view sometimes visual field loss may cause a blind spot or scotoma that affects one or both eyes this issue may also occur in the center of the visual field In this cases looking at an object may make it disappear from the field of view in some people visual field loss may occur at the top or top or bottom of the eye 
resulting in the loss of the upper or lower area of the field of vision. Alternatively, it might affect peripheral vision, which is the part of the visual field near the edges of the eyes. Other cases may affect a visual field quadrant, resulting in the loss of one quarter of the visual field. Visual neglect. A stroke can also affect how the brain processes visual information. This impairment can cause several visual processing problems. The most common type of problem is visual neglect. Visual neglect or spatial inattention occurs when a person does not respond to visual stimuli in the areas that the stroke affected. They may not be aware of or respond to things on the affected side. Visual neglect may occur on its own or along with other issues such as visual field loss. Having both may make treatment difficult to make some training techniques less effective. Agnosia Agnosia is a rare neurological disorder that occurs due to a stroke. People will be unable to retrieve information associated with visual memory from damaged areas of the brain. As a result, a person may have trouble recognizing familiar sights in their visual field. This includes common objects, familiar faces, and everyday sights that may not make sense. Eye movement issues. Depending on the area of the brain that the stroke affects, a person may also experience issues with physical eye movements. If a stroke affects the nerve control of the eye muscles, a person may have difficulty controlling the movement of the eye or the visual field itself. Some may experience nystagmus, a, con a constant movement of the eyes. The movement may be unsteady or jittery and the eyes may move back and forth along one axis or in a circle. Others may experience too much movement in the eye such as rapid eye jiggling or turning. A person may have difficulty moving their eyes in a certain direction or controlling them while tracking an object in their visual field. The eyes may jump or flick when the person gauges at an object. Eye movement issues may also affect the way a person judge, judges the distance between objects. Blurred vision. Damage that affects nerve control may also, also cause blurred vision or double vision. Diplopia. Blurred vision may go away with rehabilitation and training in some cases, but in others the symptoms may persist. Other issues. Other visual problems may occur after a stroke. For example, some people may have issues with light sensitivity. Others may have problems blinking or fully closing their eyes, which may also lead to other symptoms such as burning or irritation from very dry eyes. Issues such as loss of balance and coordination or changes in depth perception may also occur. It can be harder to maintain balance if a person cannot see clearly and they may, they may bump into things or stumble as a result. Certain problems with the vision may go unnoticed or undiagnosed or be easier to ignore than others. However, Getting a diagnosis from an eye specialist in, is important in determining the best treatment. Treatment of vision problems. 
A specialist can help out to gather a treatment plan for vision problems with the aim of impro improving vision where possible. Training Some training techniques may help the eyes adjust to blind spots or areas of vision loss. For example, scanning is the process of training in the eyes to navigate around the areas of vision loss. It encourages people to look to their left and right sides in a systematic way. This approach helps an individual make the most of their remaining vision. Eye doctors may also use audio and visual stimuli combinations during training to help retain the eyes to compensate for visual field loss or loss of depth perception. Balance training or special awareness training may help with loss of coordination or equilibrium. Early and frequent training can cause some recovery in the first few months after a stroke. However, research from 2019 notes that many visual defects become permanent in a high percentage of patients. Corrective Lenses Glasses and corrective contact lenses generally do not help with vision loss from a stroke. However, some special types of corrective lenses may help with specific issues. For example, a person can use a prism on one or both lenses of their glasses. Prisms shift the direction of light coming into the eye to help change how a person perceives objects. They may help move objects into the person's field of view or prevent the individual from looking into an area of vision loss. Consulting a doctor. After a stroke, a person should work closely with their healthcare team to discuss any possible visual symptoms. A doctor may refer them to a specialist even if they do not have noticeable symptoms. Doctors spe specializing in eye and brain issues include neuro-optometrists -opt and neuro-ophthalmologists. These professionals diagnose and treat neurological conditions that affect the visual system and conditions affecting the nerve pathways that connect the eyes to the brain respectively. Tips for managing vision problems. Doctors may offer other at-home instructions to care for the eyes and vision issues. Depending on the underlying vision issue and how it affects a person, doctors may give the person special instru instructions such as avoiding driving at night or in low light situations, using over-the-counter eye drops to prevent dryness, wearing sunglasses or anti-glare glasses to reduce light sensitivity, using in-home training aids to or equipment to continue training including low vision aids such as magnifiers. Making changes around the home to prevent falls such as installing guard, guard rails and safety lights, using rulers and markers when reading to highlight the beginning and end of sentences and maintain a position along a line of text.